Hello creative friends, this is Joy. So this is the fourth video in a series of videos that I'm making on creating a junk journal. And here's the junk journal I created. So if you uh, haven't seen those videos on creating the junk journal, decorating the edges, and then making paper clips to put in the junk journal, uh, you might want to go back and you know watch those videos. And so here I'm just taking the leftover paper from um, covering the inside of my junk journal and cutting them down so that they fit the width of the pages for pockets and the length of the pages for belly bands. And so that's what I'm doing here. I was just measuring to find out like how long um, does it need to be for a belly band and how wide does it need to be for pockets. And so here, this bigger piece, I'm trying to figure out like how many can I get out of this big piece? Um, how many pockets? How many belly bands, if any? And um, I wanted to also do like some side tucks. And so what I end up doing is cutting a few more of the pockets, the size of the other two. And then I decide to cut the rest up into side tucks. So here I'm trying to figure out like, you know, if I cut this diagonally, you know, how how many um, side tucks can I get out of it? So I decided if I cut it in half and then cut that diagonally, I can get four. So I was able to get four side tucks, four pockets, and two belly bands from the scraps that were left over from covering the inside of the journal. And so now that I've got um, all of these pieces cut, I'm deciding like how I want to decorate these pockets um, that I'm gonna put in the junk journal. I have this lace, which is the same lace that I use to decorate my some of the, uh, the edges of some of my papers. And so I thought that would be really pretty to put on these pockets. And so that's what I'm doing here. I'm just putting a bead of glue across the top of the pocket and then adding the lace onto the pocket. And I'm using um, three and one glue, which I would not recommend. It's really smelly, <laughs> it, which is what I've been using the whole time that I've been creating this journal. And I mean, it works okay, but man, it's got a really strong odor to it. So if you have a, you know any issues with strong odors, definitely do not get this glue. <laughs> um, Definitely, I would I would get a different glue, but uh, so far, you know, like I said, it seems to be working okay for what I've been using it for. But um, I definitely won't be buying this glue again because, yeah, it's really strong. Even though it's it's a good, you know, it seems like to be a pretty decent glue, but whoo, the smell. <laughs> In any case, um, like I said, this is, you know, um, a video in a series of videos that I'm creating. I have several um, other videos that are coming up um, to make other elements for my junk journal. And eventually I have a video where um, I'm going to be putting it all together. So if you're wanting to see more, then please hit that subscribe button so that you'll be notified whenever other videos are posted. So I showed you there um, some washi tape, skinny washi tapes that I had in different colors and they have different designs on them and stuff that I decided I was going to use on these side tucks to um, put along the edge because then it gives it more of a finished edge there. And in the little container there I have some die cuts um, that were left over from when I was decorating paper clips in my last video. Uh, that I thought, you know, I might use some of those on some of these pockets and tags as well. Or pockets and uh, belly bands. I do use some on one of the belly bands and on these side tucks. So you'll see that here in a minute. I did have a little bit of an issue with the uh, washi tape sticking. And I mean, it probably would have been better if I ran a bead of glue along the edge and then put the washi tape down. But I ended up you know, when I went to add these to my journal, I did secure the ends, so I think they'll be fine. Um, 
but yeah, it wasn't, you know, it, was, it wasn't sticking real well, as most washi tapes are not, you know, very tacky or whatever, but uh, I was able to at least get them, you know, to stay on long enough so I get them glued into my journal. And once I got them glued down, like I said, I, you know, I'm, I, I think that they're fine now. So, yep, I'm just uh, finishing up, just adding that uh, washi tape along the edges of the tucks. So that way it kind of gives them a little bit of a finished look and a decoration. And then I'm pulling uh, some butterflies out of this uh, little container of die cuts that I had left over to add to these side tucks. So I'm just looking for some smaller ones that, you know, um, I think will work because some of them are, are kind of big and, you know, cover up too much of the, too mu you know, too much of the flowers or whatever. So I kind of am looking for some smaller butterflies to add to these uh, side tucks. And so there's a couple there that I found that are smaller that I decided would, you know, work really good and look cute on these side tucks so I glue, glue those down very cute I'm really happy with those and then the two belly bands I decided to use that same lace to put on one of the belly bands because I thought that would be really cute you know to have lace on the belly band so I'm like trying to uh, figure out where the center is, put a bead of glue, and then put the, the lace down the center. And then, because I decided if I, you know, put two pieces back to back, then that would be really cute. And you could still see the design, you know, through the lace. So that's what I'm doing there. And then I put another bead of glue and put the other lace behind it and then snip that off super cute belly band I think and then on the last one I decided just to add a couple of butterflies to that so this is pretty much the video for today on creating these uh, pockets belly bands and side tucks I hope you liked the video and if you did I appreciate if you give me a thumbs up and again if you want to see um, <coughs> the more uh, videos that are coming out um, on creating this junk journal, uh, please hit the subscribe button and the notification bell to be notified when they are posted. If you haven't seen the previous videos on creating the junk journal and creating the um, paper clips and decorating the edges and stuff, I would, you know, you can go back and watch those. So I appreciate you stopping by and watching, and we will talk to you later. Bye bye.